and dev experience uh, on data bricks. Uh, to be honest, is support to primary key and for green key? Uh, I think it was here for like, it was available for like maybe the last five, six months, maybe, if I'm not, if I'm not wrong. So they changed the display, but it was very, very easy to just create a delta table on Unity catalog, of course. You can declare your primary key, foreign key, and then automatically, for example, if you log in to Power BI, it will automatically populate the data model for you. So you don't need to go and say, okay, this column is linked to this column. It, and, and I think it's also a way to help maybe new joiners to understand uh, the, uh, the data model, how the tables is linked to the other one, maybe how to do joins. I think this for me, it's, it's, a, it's a game changer. Yeah, it's, uh, it really make data modeling easier, yes? Uh, so it's really this kind of small improvements which can uh, really improve data governance, yes? Uh, just one note I hear that primary key and foreign key is still not enforced in Databricks. So if you have duplicate values, it will not throw the error, yes? So maybe in future we will have some like uh, enforced version which will be like index uh, i think now it's mainly for modeling purposes information purposes just power bi integration and also for feature store yes because you need to and for online tables now yes because you you need to have use this indexes there yeah yeah and, and i think it's going to help uh in the future i i don't know if they do it now uh, but i suspect they if they don't they will uh like helping things like the ai assistants to be you know stronger and give you better answer like if the assistant of power bi you know that this key depends on that one uh, then it's easy to see how you will be able to make i don't know generate better sql or just give better answer or so the more I, information you have on your data model uh the smarter it's going to be yeah, because the assistant will be able to understand the, how, the, the, how the tables are linked and, and maybe if you join, ask him to join the table, then it will be much easier for him to, to yeah. Yeah, that, yeah that without would... having to guess, because if you don't have it, it's going to try to guess, you know, that customer ID and ID are the same. Mm -hmm. um, in some cases, it's fairly simple with the name, uh, but sometimes the name, you know, are pretty bad. Uh, so in that case, if you have the, the foreign key declared, uh, it can only be better. Yeah. yeah, and also it helps with like documentation, yes, because you generate this in Unity catalog and like it's ready, so you don't have to write it in Confluence and document somewhere. Yeah, 